A biosafety level three or BSL-3 lab is a very specialized lab that you can think of kind of like a submarine. It keeps everything inside. It protects the personnel that work in that laboratory to allow them to work with viruses, bacteria, and other agents that can cause severe or deadly disease. So we were really lucky we received a $7 million federal grant recently that allows us to remodel our existing BSL-3 lab, expand it into additional space, which essentially doubles our capacity to work with agents like anthrax, plague, uh, COVID-19, influenza, tuberculosis. You can think of a lot of infectious diseases that uh, affect humans. So this grant really is transformational for Toledo, University of Toledo, as well as really the state of Ohio and the nation because there's very few BSL-3 labs. And then to have this expansion into this much space with six independent uh, biocontainment labs, again, it allows us to simultaneously work with six different agents. So it really puts University of Toledo on the map as one of the few institutions around the country or at medical schools that can work with so many agents. We also have a large pot of money that's being provided to renovate existing research facilities to provide more efficient use of space, additional space, and state-of-the-art spaces for all kinds of biomedical research that'll translate into human diseases. This investment means many things. Number one, it's doubling our capability to study really deadly pathogens. Number two, it's having the capacity to recruit the best and the brightest talent from across the world to study those pathogens. Number three, it allows us to be prepared for the next pandemic or pandemics, whatever those are. And then number four, it allows us the capacity or uh, capability to have different groups of teams, scientists, physicians, uh, epidemiologists, whatever, actively work on whatever that is in a space. Hospitals around the country have clinical labs that diagnose, right, yes or no, does someone have it? This uh, facility, this BSL-3, allows you to actually grow and study the virus, um, and how it is mutating real time isolate it, isolate its, its genetic material, uh, perform uh, infection studies either in cell culture and animals, again, develop and test vaccines, new antivirals. You can't do that in clinical labs in hospitals. So under this very controlled, uh, we call it biocontainment uh, laboratory, we can carefully and safely study uh, different viruses, different bacteria, and again, tease apart how they cause disease, uh, how we can block those infections, develop and test new vaccines or test new antibiotics to prevent those diseases. It's much more than basic scientists conducting research and we're much more than just physicians who are examining and treating patients. Uh, the University of Toledo and the College of Medicine and Life Sciences you know, are actively involved in translational research, which is taking findings in the lab and putting those to practice at the bedside. But we never know what's coming next, as we all know what happened with COVID-19. This uh, transformational expansion and renovation allows us to be poised and ready for the next pandemic, whatever that may be.